Ladies and gentlemen, welcome you faces. We're playing today. Yeah, we're playing some more of the zombies in space and, and I've just run out of ammo, but it's fine. Cause we're just training around here. I'm gonna get some. But we're now on round seventy or scene seventy, should I say. Now you know what? I'm just gonna call it rounds. I'm just gonna call it rounds. It's what they're called, it's what they should be called, it's what they will always be called. But uh, yeah, I'm live streaming right here. Uh, right here. I don't even know what word I was trying to say there. But I'm streaming right now, and uh, yeah, it's amazing. I've got 130 plus people here. You know, you guys, you guys are amazing. Uh, thanks for tuning in to the people who are who are here. But uh, but yeah, so there's like man, there's actually so many people, um, so many people like talking in the chat right now. But it's hard to see um, everything going by. So I'm using the Erad and the Kendall 44 for this strategy, and it's actually really, really efficient. We're 30 rounds from um, what you call it. 30 rounds from round 100, but I'm only going for round 80. After round 80, I'm going to end the game, and uh, yeah, so I guess you could call it the round 80 will be on the world records. I'm not too sure. I'm pretty sure people have already gotten round 100, but if they haven't, then um, you, know, you know what, you know what? For like whenever a new zombie map is released these days, like, like this is the way it's always been since, since since uh no not since origins since black ops 3 came out like whenever there's a new map it's like after a few days people have already gotten around 100 and i'm getting close to around 150 but uh but yeah we're just we're just training right now we have five perks because the max perk limit for um infinite war zombies is five not four for trait zombies it was four but um it's it's pretty different it's pretty different for this so my strategy right now is just to make points using the ERAD um, to get thousands of points and then when I run out of ammo or like when I've got a full a full wave then I take them through the dragon's mouth and I let the dragon just um, slam down kill him and everything is amazing so it's it's like it's pretty straightforward it's pretty easy this map this map's easier than what I anticipated after my first attempt uh, the only difficult thing about it is those monsters that drop in, you know, those boss zombies that drop in. Because, like, them massive boss zombies, you know them? Yeah, yeah, they can, they can kill you, they can kill you pretty goddamn easily. Am I reading the chat? Um, well, it's, it's sort of hard to do right now because there's so many people talking in there. But, uh, I try, I try, bro, I try. So, just, just look at that, we got points, and it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good. So it's just pretty. It's pretty straightforward, and uh, yeah. So we uh, we have no souvenir coin. We don't really need it. Uh, we don't really need it at all. So the training, like the way that training works, is pretty similar to what Trey Zombies is. Um, there is so yeah. It's pretty. It's pretty straightforward. Pretty straightforward to train the zombies. You know, it's basically like Trey You know with just a, just a little bit different just a little bit different uh your highest round is 50 oh that's uh it's pretty amazing it's pretty it's pretty amazing it's halfway to round 100 so uh you should be proud of that you should be proud of it um am i going to use my uh cards of fortune um uh, you mean fatal fortune cards um i don't really need to you don't really need to to be honest it's it's like you can play the old school type of zombies were. If if I'm like if I'm like if I'm completely honest, all you need to do is get the pack punch, get the erad, and keep the starting pistol and pack a punch it. It's literally easy. You don't need to get the Easter egg, uh, the Easter egg thing done to give you the like the what's it called to give you the um, like the second pack a punch effects for the guns. Uh, you know, like blast furnace, like in this case, it's like venom, fire, and like that, and wind. You don't, you don't need to get that. You don't. All you need to do is open a pack of punch, and get the erad, which is a very, it's a, it's like, it's a really, really cheap gun, and keep your starting pistol and pack a punch it. To be honest, all you need to do is pack with one weapon, and get these perks. You, you're set. You, you're pretty much set to go. It's like literally so straightforward. It's like I can't stress this enough. It's so straightforward. But uh, yeah, but this is 
this is like really really easy right now so uh, so yeah I mean just, just look it's like it's literally so easy I get things done it's, it's amazing it's, it's, it's literally amazing so I'm just gonna check these guys through here I'm like just gonna slam down but I think I'm gonna end this video here because I'm live streaming and I just want to get a small video of gameplay to put on YouTube because you know you know just small segment of gameplay just so you know that it's pretty easy sometimes you're going to be forced to go through the tunnel and run back around but that's all fine because it all loops around as you'll see here i like look i'm going to run i'm like look look where i'm running all you need to do is run over here you know jump down here and look we're back where where we just were like if that happens it's all fine and if you get chased out of the opposite way like on that side just run back just like basically just like you know run back through the tunnel to get to here where i am now so uh yeah but if you have enjoyed them be sure to like comment subscribe and i'll catch you guys later but until next time peace